れはい、everyone! Welcome back to some more Let's Play Bug Fables! In the last episode, I believe we did some boss battles, defeating the Seedling King and the Aphid Queen. We took a few other side quests and completed those as well. And I think we're going to see if there's anything else we can do in that regard. Otherwise, we're just going to wander around and explore a little bit and see if we can get ourselves into any trouble. And if we can't find anything else to do, then either near the end of this episode or starting in the next one, we will go ahead and begin the, act the main quest. So, first, here's all the items I have on me at the moment. And here are the medals that we have equipped. Yep, no talking. <laughs> okay, so if we're going to wander around outside, and I'm intending to do that, the first thing I would think we're going to do is take off Crazy Prepared and put on Bug Me Not. We also want to get Charmed, something I keep forgetting to do, so let's handle that right now. Hello there, lovelies! Welcome to my humble star! Here, okay, we already know this. Overcharmed. There you go. Now you're all charmed up. Who knows how it'll help you out? All right, yes, we know. All right, thank you. All right, so where are we off to then? So, let's visit the inn and take a look at the quest board. I think most of the quests that we've left are ones we cannot actually accomplish, if I recall correctly, though. I think there's one that needs us to be in Meadow Island, and I think we completed all the other ones. Yep, okay, so, the only thing I can think of that we might still want to do is explore some of the old lands we've left behind and see if our metal goes off to let us know there's a secret there and or explore the jungle again. So, so let's do those things. Right, there was something hidden down there. Okay, so, don't have to worry about any bugs because we had the buggy knot metal on. They will be much lower level. And we shouldn't have to worry about fighting them. I think we've full ex fully explored the desert, so I don't think there's be anything here for us to fight. Or, well, now that, now that we defeated that one water boss two episodes ago, I don't think there's anything else... Except maybe at the Oasis. No, 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 no. There's nothing at the Oasis either. Alright, so... Last time... Oh my god, scared the heck out of me last time we were here. I think we went north, so let's try going this way this time. Oh, uh, we were totally here. I know we were. Oh, we got something special up there, if I recall correctly, didn't we? I think we did. Oh, guys, I can't remember. But we not metal. Maybe we weren't here. I don't remember this location. Ooh. 
Hmm. Okay, we'll need to break those down. So let's do that with Kaboo. And we switch to Leaf. Get us across this. Is there anything over here, by the way? Oh, there is. But our metal's not going off, so there's no, nothing here that's a secret. Ooh, a whole lot of work to traverse this area of the jungle. Let's see. Well, this is a good time as any to see if these things are immediately destroyed. They are. Okay, good. A mushroom. We don't need a mushroom. Oh, we're still a little low on TP points, what have you. I did not even notice that. Oh, I feel like we were here before, but we didn't. We either got something from here, or we didn't know what we needed to do to interact with this. Maybe, maybe we were here. I just have a really bad memory. The last... So, when I was playing this game, I would have been here back in April. So, and that's two and uh, almost three months ago because it was it was like early april april yeah we've been here before it's been a long time though did we fight something here oh we're here Okay, so we did all that for nothing. <laughs> we did get a back way into the wasps, uh, but we don't have to explore the wasp area. I can't think of any reason why we want to go back to the wasp hive at this moment. I think this also meant that everything is respawned in this area. Not that that matters very much. Maybe there is nothing out in the jungle, Tim. Hmm. I'm oh, sorry, everyone. My mind's trying to think of what, where we went in the jungle. I'd hate for you guys to be bored watching me do a bunch of stuff that we've already done without any reward for it, as it were. I know we've been there before. What happens if we go north? Okay, this is new. That little, oh, that's the front gate to the Wasp Kingdom. Oh, look what it is, everyone. Look what we found. A lore book. A chunky book with the ant crest on its cover. Probably belongs in the Ant Palace's library. And we can probably make it to this. And Kaboo can dig for us. Dark cherries. We don't have much free inventory space at this moment, so if we want to keep those, and I do. Or do I? Do we care about dark cherries anymore? I mean, we do care. I'm oh, sorry, that's the wrong way to phrase that. We do care about dark cherries, but they're 50, 50 bucks, and we've got 3,000 bucks. So, we don't really need to worry about affording something like dark cherries any longer. I am glad we found that lore book, though. So that made coming out to the jungle... I mean, that's a weird thing for me to say, right? Given how much I hate... <laughs> how much I hate the lore books. But I only hate the lore books because they're given as a reward for something. This, that's As V would say, it's not a reward. <laughs> it's not. It's not a reward. All right. I guess we are going to go to the jungle. We can always get out of there via that one item we have. The uh, crystal that brings us back to the hub. If we don't end up not wanting to be here. I don't think we're allowed in the one place to the south, uh, southwest here. Where was that? 
south. It wasn't to the southwest. I'm thinking of some other place. Hmm. Can we go this way with using you, Leaf? We can. I apologize in advance when I mess this up. It's hard. To... It's hard to see. Uh, vertically. Is it vertically? From north to south. If I've got the distance I need to make it onto these. Bud, stop falling in the water. I know you're thirsty. You're a plant. But we don't need you to do that. Why do I feel like this is a place we've been before also? Oh, I think this is where, where we met... Uh, the Ant Warrior. It is. So we've been here before. Okay, so... Well, we, we, we did that. We did what we just did. So let's go ahead and explore... From this side? Oh, more water. I don't think there's anything in this area, Tim, that you missed. I think it was only the jungle. This is where we fought... The giant armored centipede. We did find a lore book, so might as well save while we're here. We are, we are down some TP, so we might as well use the Venus healing. Take advantage of our little uh, discount. Yeah, I don't think we forgot anything here. This is where we learned how to do that. Okay, I I don't think there's anything out here we forgot. So let's go back. In which case, we should not have healed because we could have just rested at our home. Oh, but we, I guess we'll turn in the lore book and check our discoveries really quick. Oh, is this the last lore book? Maybe this is the last lore book. Hi there, came in to turn some discoveries? Let's see how you've done. This time you have 40 discoveries. Last time you found 33. Looks like you have enough for the next reward tier. Here you go. A crystal berry. Oh, you still have enough for the next reward tier. Well done. Another one. That seems to be all for now. Come back once you found more discoveries. Oh, hey, it's you. Did you find any books? Ah, wonderful. That is one of ours, yes. I'll put it on the shelf, so check it out whenever. That might be the last of them, unless the above shelf is for more books, in which case, wow! We have a lot more left to this game <laughs> than even I thought we did. I think we're over halfway. I think we're maybe two-thirds? Or maybe after we're done with the Termite Kingdom, we're two-thirds. But I think... I, I, there's a lot. There's a lot of stuff here, which I love. Okay, so... I guess we leave the Dark Cherries behind? And we... We'll go back to the seedling area? And we'll see if there's anything else there for us to explore. No, I'm not going to go. I'll, I can always off-screen wandering around with the metal on to see if I miss any secrets, but I don't think we have. Oh, I forgot the shop is open, by the way. Is there anything? I think there's... Oh, there's tea up here we can get, I think, right? On occasion. Yeah. Oh, oh no, there isn't. That's her home. That's her tea. The burly tea. 
Okay, so... Well, crap, I think... Yeah, let's head out here to the seedlings really quick, and if we don't find anything out here, like another place for us to possibly explore, then I think we're we're going to go to the Termite Kingdom. I can't tell if there's anything back there, so let's take a peek. No, okay. We know that that lead to, led to this king, and there's nothing else that out that way. So my eyes are drifting over to the far side over there to see if there's anything else we could possibly fly onto. Uh, so over there, there's something, right? Oh, but we're not allowed over there. Okay, we're not allowed over there. And we can't make it over there on the other side. We don't have the height to get up on that, uh, to that other section of the, the, oh my goodness, I can't speak today. We can't make it on, on that side either. Okay, so there's nothing here at the ceiling cube. All right, so then let's head on over back to the termite area then. Probably one of those bosses we're looking for is over there, is my guess. The false mon- no, the false monarch is in Metal Island, right? I don't remember. Alright, so anyway... <laughs> let's, uh, let's go this way. Oh, right, there's the item there buried, so V. Another crystal berry. We're also going to put back on our crease prepared. since I do want to do some of these fights because we're looking for golden seedlings. Hmm. And we know that thing is considered difficult enough for us to be forced to fight it if we have to. I don't see anything else up there we need to fight and that we haven't explored and our metal's not going off. And wow, it's been a while since I've seen this area, guys. Two, two and a half months just about, right? Or so, two months? At least two months. Let's speak with this guy again. <laughs> Welcome back, friends. Did you manage to find your way? Indeed. Thanks for your help. <laughs> I see the Ant Queen is no longer with you. So I suppose you could be interested in my services, then? We are unsure. This seems really shady. My friend, you are wrong there. All I do is honest work. My services can change your stats around. Picked a wrong bonus during ranking up? I can fix that for you. For a price, of course. <laughs> oh, respec! I don't like this, but I guess it could be useful. I have two operations here, stat conversion and point conversion. With stat conversion, I can extract all your level up and stat bonuses and convert them into potions. 
What you do with the potions then is up to you. But that's where the, my second service comes in. The potion conversion. With that, I can change a potion type into another. That way you can change the bonus you want to receive. Uh... What do you mean by extract? <laughs> I assure you, it won't hurt much, my friend. Give it some thought, all right? You know where to find me. I have a bad feeling about this. I am a fan of never respecting in games that have respects. <laughs> so, uh, I, t I like plotting and planning everything out from the very beginning. But I can totally see why you might want to respect in this game. If you've leveled up your hit points a whole lot and you're playing on normal mode and you're like, this is way too easy. I really want more metal points. This is where I guess you get to do that from. It sounds like a respec, uh, the ones, one of the operations takes all of our statistics, drains them back to normal, and gives us a bunch of potions which effectively level us up. And then we can drink those potions to give us the level ups that we had taken or convert a potion into another potion. Uh, I'm not really interested in this, though. There seems to be a mix of receipts and orders along the wall. Elias, Dr. Patton's patent, pending. Anti-obfuscation to ocular lens. Specky, aphid feed, aka aphid. John, Dr. Patton's patent, pending, snake mouth oil. Jerry, one, one. Genuine spooder spy card. Hmm. Can we talk to you about those things? Oh, nothing, thanks. Okay, we cannot. Spooters? <laughs> Spooters is uh, spiders? Is that a thing? Alright, so... Oh, I see we're rank 24, everyone. I think there's 26 total ranks, so we're practically max level also. And all that did was take us right back here again. Now, I don't remember how we got to the Termite Kingdom from here. I think we did unlock a way to get there instantly through the Ant Kingdom's tunnels. But I want to explore out here, I think. So if we go straight south, that brings us right back here again. Okay. And if I go east, we're someplace new. So south is the wrong way. What if we go back north? Okay, so that's the same. And west? There's something here we did not find. Ah! Okay, so the big ones are obviously, or I think are obviously more dangerous, but I kind of want to hit all of them to start. So let's, let's have the attack one of the big ones to weaken it. And then we'll do an ice fall. Actually, let's turn relay back to V first. Get Leaf in the front and then do an Ice Fall. Plus one damage. This kind of changes things now that we've also got the second one uh, iced. Hit points left. 
Bud can kill that one. And I think this is over. We should absolutely hit that one with V, and I think I really want to guarantee that dies. It's more important to kill that than the little one. Bud can now kill the big one. Oops, then uh, I just said that and attacked it anyway. Not thinking is not my strong suit, viewer. Wow. So, I think the Bug Me Not medal will prevent me from having to do those battles. If it was only worth one experience point. So, let's put that back on again. Okay, so... I think we've fully explored this area before, but no, we, that can't be the true, because we, we got the metal sim, uh, symbol going off. Signal going off. Which means there's something in this place that we want to explore or find. There we go. This is where we want to be. Good. Okay. And they die immediately. She's going to have to worry about fighting them. I guess we're going this way with UV. Oh, I see the arrow pointing this way. I feel like we've been here before with the queen, though. We've done this particular stuff before. Something up that way, I think. Not cute. <laughs> Not cute. All that's going to do is bring me back to where I started from. Interesting. So where's the secret in this area? Is it the bottle caps? We're not allowed onto them. I'm gonna leave and come back. Yeah, there's something here. Okay, where is it? I guess I, I could cut the recording really quick, everyone, and try to see if I could find it. So I'll do that so you guys don't have to watch me poke about. Guys, I think I found it. There's a little platform over here, I think, we haven't been to before. Uh. <laughs> All right. It's a lore book. How about that? So that must mean the upper shelf is, can still be filled with books. All right. Well, then let's go south. Same, this is the same place we were j literally just at, only we arrived from a different angle. A 
Okay, let's see if this direction takes us anywhere. It does, okay. What is this? A symbol of the ant kingdoms here. It's as if these were, like, gates or something, or a giant wall. Unless this is the Termite Kingdom symbol. I don't think that's the case, right? That's the Ant Kingdom symbol. Were the Termites, like, imprisoned? Or was there, like, a, some sort of siege? In, the, in a wall or something put up around them? Hmm. Sure, we'll go back north. Or back north, we'll go north. Ah! Uh, darn it. Alright, so now we're back here at the very start. Alright, so let's go back. We have to do all this over, kind of over again. It won't take that long to get back to where we just were, everyone. Whoa, no, I don't want to be flung off, though. I do, but not until V's in the front. That was this way. So we learned we don't want to go up there. How about this way? That's an interesting looking bug. Reminds me of the... Oh, what was it called now? The Dash Master? Oh! Notice what's underneath of it as it moves. When his cloak opens a bit. See the eyes? Is that... Is that one of the bosses we get... We have to fight? Doesn't look like False Monarch, but it, that's a... That's an enemy. Oh, or is it? I don't trust any of these things. <laughs> I don't trust any of these things, so I don't think I should. Yeah, Ant, King, Ant Kingdom symbols. So they, they must have had a settlement out here at some point. Yup! Uh... Something about these bugs rubs us the wrong way. Indeed, they seem intelligent, but avoid conversation. They can all be weird if they want. Let's keep looking around. This place has seen much better days. Why do all these bugs want to live here? Their choice of home is not the only strange thing about them. They do give off a peculiar feeling. Let's be on guard. Sit and rest a bit. Aren't you tired? Sit and rest. Sit at the bench and rest for a little while. Ah, there is a Venus here. So there's this is one of the boss battles. Hey guys, Venus here. Have you come for healing? Just so for, for, for us talk. The settlement was used by the very first Ant Queen when she first arrived in these lands. But now it's full of these weird mask-wearing bugs. What's their deal? If this is a battle, let's prepare for it. So we won't need hard... Uh, we want hard mode on. We won't need bug me not. And I'm going to risk that we won't need victory or triumph buzz. That gives us seven points back. Can I get one more point so I can get front 
defense. I don't think we can. I don't think I can find one more point. To, I don't think you can. I like everything else I have equipped at the moment. Yeah, I'm not going to equip anything else. Okay, so. Equip anything else. I'm sorry. I'm not going to unequip anything I currently have equipped. So. Four points. That's one three point and one five point or two four points. Sorry, everyone. I'm doing a lot of thinking. Uh, let's give... Oh, I said three and five. No, it's three and four, or five and two. I think we will give Leaf Cloak to V to make her less likely to be attacked. We give TP Core to the group, and we give HP Core to Kaboo. Okay, let's do that. Save the game. And let's investigate this place a little more. <laughs> I love how creepy it is. Uh, okay, we've already read this. I love that all of us see what's happening, but the but these uh, our protagonists do not see the obvious that these are these are what they are. You're the only one that's not walking around. Do you say anything different? You, you do not. I feel kind of bad that we're going to kill this thing be because it, it feels like we're invading their home and killing their leader. And they haven't done anything wrong other than being out here, being weird, and they're allowed to be. I mean, well, maybe they're not allowed to be weird, but I have no problem with them being weird out here. But they're a boss battle. Yep, false monarch. Let's see what you're about, shall we? All right, you guys know the drill by now. We get our, our group into the proper positioning, and we start by scanning this thing so that we understand a little bit about it before we go and begin fighting it. You, you can't scare me! You're just a bunch of moth flies under a coat! It's charging up, Leap! We gotta block it! Okay, it has a big power attack that we'll have to use bubble shield for. It seems these critters are under a royal delusion. Enough to grow quite powerful. We must save some TP if we're to endure its strongest moves. Your collective's days of luring weary travelers to this town end right now. Oh, is that what they're doing? I, how did you know that, Kaboo? Stay sharp, Leaf. We may need your defensive skills. Okay, lots of hints that we're going to need to uh, use a bubble shield. Well, let's do... Let's think. S can we maybe... F I don't think we can freeze it, but let's try for your coffin. We can freeze it. Now we got a TP point back from that. Uh... I, do we attack it anyway, or do we wait around? I think we attack it anyway. So, let's... What items did I bring with me? We did bring spicy candy, but we're down TP. So I would like to wait to use that. So, let's use...
let's use Empower. For two rounds, she's empowered. And now we're down that TP. So now we can go ahead and use Spicy Candy. And now for four turns, V has plus one attack. And we're going to whack it. Which is a big mistake to do it. Th well, we could wait around, I guess. We could wait around. Hit it next round and then all our other characters can act again. We lose one round on this extra attack. Though, if we do that. Let's, let's hit it. So, let's use Tornado Toss. was five damage on a perfect block. Holy crap that this thing is going to hurt. <laughs> oh, wow. All right. So let's taunt with Kabu. We will use a tornado toss. And then we can use an item. We'll use... I think Sweet Pudding. But attacks. Good God! <laughs> Oh, thank goodness I did, like, two perfect blocks at the end. That was nightmarish. Each of those did five damage. That could have dropped Kaboo had I not done, I think, two. I think they were perfect blocks. Holy crap. All right, turn relay trick. And we absolutely do a tornado toss here. Oh, man. I ex I'm waiting for it to charge up, so... Before I use a bubble shield, so... That was a lot of damage, though. Kaboo needs a big heal, but I don't have any other single-target big heals. Actually, no, we do. We have a Leaf Amulet, which Leaf can use. <laughs> uh, let's have Kaboo use it on himself. Because I'll try a Fritchie Coffin on him again. Alright, did not freeze him. My goodness. Okay, let's start with an ice fall here. I was hoping we get all three of them. Bud can kill the front one. We should kill the back one if I attack it, so I'm going to do that. And we'll use a cherry pie.
And can we kill it? I think we might be able to kill it this round. So let's turn Relay to Leaf, who turn Relay's back to V. And we're gonna go all out and try it. So if we can push and cough in it, we will... We will end it. And we can. So I think we did it. I think. Thank you, Charmed. That was amazing. You got the Crystal Crown! Woo! Do the bugs out there attack us when we leave? I hope not. Because uh, I'm not sure I'm ready for that. Let's use a Honey Ice Cream. We have plenty of this. They probably won't, but thematically I'm going to pretend they will. So let's do that. Let's walk out there and see if they're going to fight us. Actually, let's look around here first. The metal didn't go off, so I'm imagining that there is, there will be no, uh, no secrets here. Oh, but there is one here that we missed. Oh, they all fled, leaving just the masks. Interesting. You know, I don't see where a spot would be for a secret. Oh, hold on. There has to be something here, right? Because... No. No, that's for Kabu. Oh, hello. Aha. Clever. <laughs> oh, lore book. There's still another secret here. Two secrets. Interesting. Well, let's get healed up fully now. Hey guys, Venus here. I've come for healing just full, full, full over five berries. Here you go. <laughs> and do you say anything else now that we've cleaned this place up? Probably not, right? Huh. The weird bugs all left. I suppose you had something to do with that, right? I like when games do little things like that and add that when things change, the topics, uh, what gets discussed changes. Hmm. There's another secret here, supposedly, though, right? guys see it? None of those rocks can be broken down. We've already explored it inside the hut. Is it this? Is it that one thing I can't reach? Do I have to take that down somehow? We can reach it, so we should we should try cutting it. It might have something pop out of it. A magic seed. That must that must have been it. Okay, not bad. That's a that's an 18 cost item. Not that we need to worry about the money anymore, though. And since the metal didn't go off, I'm assuming it, it's all... Yep, okay, that was it. Let's now prepare to be back adventuring as per normal, right? So...
we'll take off HP core, TP core, leaf cloak. And we put back on Triumph Buzz, Victory Buzz, and Bug Me Not. All right, so I guess we'll go back now to the Termite Kingdom and we'll end the session there. If I can do this really quickly and cleverly, it would be amazing. Oh, Tim, you're going the wrong way. Am I? I might be. <laughs> now, this is this is where we want to be. Oh my goodness, the fast, the racing snails. I think we want to. Oh, aren't there there are pumpkins here? Right, there are pumpkins here. not forgotten about you pumpkins that's another one oh racing snails we gotta go up we gotta go up so how do we go up I see It's okay. We can use V. V gets a little bit more height when she flies. There we go. And I think it was this way. Up there was the look over at the termite mound. And this way brings us back to the Ant Kingdom, if I recall correctly. Oh, no, we haven't been here before. Oh, we fell. It'll be okay. Oh, yeah, we haven't been here before. Uh, you know what? We'll explore out this way later, then. In the next episode. Let's get to the Termite Mound. Oh, no. This was the direction to the Ant Kingdom, I think, right? Yeah, through this area. Okay. So we don't need the magic seed. And guys, I guess we'll stop here. So uh, I'm going to head back to our home, and I'll do some inventory management stuff to make sure we're outfitted for whatever's up ahead. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I want to make another cherry pie at the very least. All right, guys. So I'm Babylon. Thank you guys for watching. And I will see you all in the next one. Take care, everyone. Actually, <laughs> actually, we want to turn that quest in. So let's do that before we call the session. I wouldn't leave you guys hanging. It just occurred to me right when I was about to do some cooking. That, oh, right. We should turn this in first, shouldn't we? And we totally had the bug me not uh, the, the hard momento on. So we should check one more time to see if we got anything special for completing that quest. With the... Uh, with the hard metal on. By completing the quest, I mean defe defeating that the false monarch. Back already? Ah, I see you defeated that nasty false monarch. Might have that crystal it dropped. Yes, this is a genuine deal. Here's your reward. Last stand medal. Increases the ally's defense by two when low on hit points. 50 berries. Nice doing business with you. Please find the other bounties and your reward will be waiting. I think we've got... Yeah, all we have is that.
electric needles for five crystal bear. Okay. Well, all right, guys. So now I will stop. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Take care, everyone.